lost again going back around Dreaming of a time when I get things right Lost in the shadows of a million stars Shouldn't they in my mind near and far Shouldn't they at all just tell me where you are Send a prayer if I'm out The last time we were with Deb and Joel and Maya of Chasing RV Sunshine was back in August, August 21st through the 24th in Wisconsin. So now they're joining us in Austin for some adventures. Our first stop is 121 Pickle for Cosmic Coffee. It's just right off Congress. And I can see why our daughter and her husband highly recommend this place. You can get coffee, you can get beer, and you can get some craft, crafted cocktails. Um, they also have, usually on hand, three food trucks in their garden. And it is just a beautiful place to hang out. Lots of people were there this morning, and it literally was a beautiful day to sit outside. It's also very dog friendly. <laughs> I was fixing to say that's not beer, is it? Oh, you want a flavor? Yeah. You want some flavor in there? Yeah. Surprise me. What you think? Something that's creative. <laughs> Sunshine and living the silver life together again in Austin. They also have food trucks. Love their outdoor environment. Look at this. Have a waterfall. They really have done something to improve the bank over here. It's beautiful. South Congress isn't far from the Capitol. And if you want to see Texas and anything that looks like or represents Texas, then South Congress is the place to be. You've got the ever popular Allen Boots, plus all kinds of other Southwestern art. Anything and everything Texas. Plus, there are tons of places to eat and get yourself a refresher and just really enjoy yourself. We literally just looked around. We didn't buy anything, but we had a good time looking. Okay, so the guys had to come into Hudson Meats. They have a food truck out front too, so. And then if you don't want to make your own or grill your own, they also have the Hudson Meat Market food truck out front. Sixth Street used to be known as Pecan Street, 
because all the streets running east to west in Austin were named after trees, and the north to south streets were named after Texas rivers. But it is a historic street, and it is an entertainment district in Austin. It's located within the city's urban core in downtown Austin. Baby, I'm stuck with a halfway heart. Slip away if I come too far. Pick me up when I'm in pieces. Oh, that halfway heart of mine is a rolling stone. Make me roll right home. Halfway heart. The oasis on Lake Travis is at 6550 Comanche Trail in Austin. The oasis on Lake Travis is nestled in Austin's hill country and it overlooks Lake Travis. It's become the sunset capital of Texas where you can enjoy delicious food and drinks while watching all the activity going on on Lake Travis and then sticking around for a beautiful sunset. Okay guys, so what did you think about your first day in Austin, official? Love the weather. Yeah, the love, weather was amazing. Love downtown and the Oasis and the Oasis restaurant is absolutely fabulous to watch the sunset. It's huge, isn't it? Yeah. It's absolutely huge. It's definitely something to see. But the food is amazing and the margarita was amazing. Um, but I think my favorite thing was just hanging out with you guys. Aww. Getting to see this area um, besides being in Wisconsin where we've met up the last couple of times. That's true. The weather here in Texas is way nicer than the <laughs> Wisconsin weather. I don't know. When we were there this summer, it was pretty <laughs> fabulous. I think you'd say something different about Texas if you were here during the summer Probably. versus where you are now. Probably. So this feels like here in the winter, and then you come see us in Wisconsin during the summer. That sounds like a plan. So this is a good plan. That That's is a, nice a good part one. about full timing. You don't have to stay where it's terrible. No. <laughs> Pick and choose by the weather. Yeah, exactly. And if you can't find sunshine, you can always make your own. There you there. Well, we're not going to have a sunshine here pretty soon. So join us next week as we travel to Driftwood to eat at the famous original Salt Lick Barbecue with Chasing RV Sunshine, Deb and Joel. Plus, we'll visit Salt Lick Cellars and Dushman Winery before heading to Central Machine Works for pizza. Hope you had a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year to you all. To me if I lose my voice Is a better route if I lose my core? Company and I will come Save me when I am falling Save me when I am falling Save my love when I fall Baby, I'm sorry
stuck with 